All right, so hello, welcome to One Message in a Bottle Tarot. My name is Juan and I'm your spiritual advisor. Welcome to all my new messengers and those uh, who have been hanging in there and riding with us on this journey. All the new subscribers, thank you for all the likes and the love. All right, so we're doing your September monthly. And uh, this will be a new uh, thing I'm um, introducing. Um, I found these interesting cards while treasure hunting and vintage shopping. And I said, wow, these would be some really uh, intuitive cards for a kind of a, I'm feeling like a spiritual warfare sense um, in the collective over the last week. And I feel strongly moving into um september that we're definitely going to need to have our spiritual cards up and so i thought why not uh see what these magical cards uh can can give us some um some tools to really protect us and let us know what's coming so we don't get blindsided all right again i've never uh seen these cards before don't know what they're going to say i'm just going to intuitively give you a message and we're going to ride this motherfucker out all right keep in mind these are general readings they won't resonate with everyone also make sure to check your um your moon uh rising and um venus and sun and all that good stuff subscribe here to the youtube channel uh you can also subscribe to the instagram channel which is one message in a bottle tarot and you can also uh subscribe to my twitter page which is one message tarot um, my DMs are available to book readings. All the information is in the description box. And uh, yeah, so let's go. First up, Aries. All right. So what messages do you have for September in regards to spiritual warfare? Oh, for Aries. Spiritual warfare for September. All right, first card out. All right, so it says this creature is called the elf. Land war covers a million square miles, yet nobody enters the forest without the elves knowing it. Hmm. Interesting. Covers a million square miles, yet nobody enters without it knowing it, right? Be careful of the people you let around your 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 uh your magic projects, right? Your ideas, those things that you protect and and uh, hold sacred, right? Make sure they have the code, <laughs> the password, all right? Don't let nobody just be running all nilly willy around your uh, open notebooks, diaries, your computers, all right? These are dire times out here. Everybody's looking for that next um catch that's really going to help them uh, take off in these pandemic times so pr protect your protect your uh your treasures all right all right so we have standing troops okay the creature is called a soldier attacking doesn't cause standing troops to tap all right, they fight so closely together, a mouse couldn't slip past their guard. All right, yeah, Aries, protect your shit. Right, you got to be on guard in September. Right, this is spiritual warfare here. Right, I'm hearing you need to really tighten up. Right, you might have some um, some leaks in the corner somewhere, a few cracks in your foundation. Right, and um. As, as long as you're standing like 10 toes down, uh, really having that thick skin being, you know, impenetrable. I'm not saying that right, but you get it. <laughs> as, as long as you uh, really, uh, with, a, with a tight fist, uh, protecting your properties and, and, and your ideas. Okay. And your business, whatever, your home, love, everything, right? Tighten up and, and make sure you know who's on the other side of the peephole. All right. Um, if you don't leave the door unlocked, they can't get in, right? So you fight closely together. All right. The next one up, Honor Guard, also a soldier, right? The strength of one, the courage of ten. Yeah, yeah. Aries. 
You don't need as much as you think you do, right? You've always been good at standing tall, standing on your own, right? You don't need uh, too many uh, people in the kitchen. You don't need too many outside opinions, okay? You have the ability to safeguard and, and to protect your interests on, the, on your own, right? You may think you need all of these outside helps and opinions, but you, you really don't. You've always had the mind. You've always had the instinct. But this September is like, it's really, really uh, check the fine print and, and make sure uh, everyone around you is who they say they are. Because I, I feel like uh, someone's trying to um, slip you the okie doke while you're not looking. Okay. And let's see. This uh, card is called the Wind Drake, Creature Drake, Flying. But high she shoots through the air and light, above all low delay, where nothing earthly bounds her flight, nor shadow dims her way. Oh, that I had wings. Yes. If there is one thing you know how to do, Aries, and that is to win, and that is to uh, outsmart uh, your enemies, outsmart your competitors. You have the ability to really, you know, just fly high above the bullshit, right? Not really get your wings dirty or really get your wings in, entangled or, or muddled with uh, lower vibrational, you know, energies, right? Really flying above... Um, the ruckus flying above the noise and you do that by knowing who you are knowing i mean this is a dragon it's a mystical creature right you see these wings like you know who i am right right and so the way you really succeed is how you've always done is really just being above it all and having that that sharp focus and um, that that intent on knowing who, what, when, where, and most importantly, why. That will be uh, very important for you um, coming up in September because you have um, some trolls or, or, or some type of energies that are looking for a chink in your armor, looking for your weak spot is what I'm hearing, right? So definitely be on guard, especially with this Pisces moon coming up. Uh, you, 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 you just, you don't want to get caught uh, blindsided. So whatever area it is that you've been neglecting or maybe something that you've handed off to someone else, you, you, you really want to, um, Make sure that you uh, you do a, a what do you call a roll call right and and make sure that every everyone's home and everyone is where they're supposed to be and everything is in good and decent and proper order and it might definitely be time to change a few passcodes uh, change a few locks um, take a few card keys I don't know I'm just feeling the energy there's like some slick behavior here and you're really gonna have to stand your guard mean what you say and execute as such uh, without um, getting 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 soiled or, or, or getting dirt on you right so definitely some tech there okay all right so uh, in and out let me do one love oracle for September all right, this is that was your spiritual warfare, it, and it's right on target. I don't know something about these cards and some of something about the energy coming up. Where I really just feel like everybody really just has to be on point. But let's get your love oracle for September. Okay. All right. So you have engagement here. Your love life is ascending to. A higher level of commitment right and you know that energy really tells me if you do have someone in mind um, Aries someone that you're entertaining or maybe you're just readying yourself uh, cleaning up different areas in your life so you know it's proper and suitable <laughs> For a mate to bring into your life, if you know you're going to be popping the question or uh, adding an addition to your family, you just want to make sure that when you bring that partner in, everything is cool, everything is culture, then I'm definitely feeling like the energy of this deck is to really get in there and clean house and remove those um, 
lower vibrational energies that just don't belong there. Uh, you're not aligned anymore. And uh, this Pisces moon will definitely make that crisp clear um, who needs to go, who's there for ulterior motives, who's get, uh, who's taking more than they um, give. But uh, yes, definitely uh, typing up and tighten up and um, make sure all is good and in proper order. And um, con congratulations on this new journey and love for you. All right. All right, Aries. So thank you so much. Make sure you like this video. Um, tag somebody, share it, okay? Subscribe here to the YouTube channel. Also subscribe to uh, One Message in a Bottle Tarot on Instagram. Also hit me up at One Message Tarot on Twitter. Um, there you can also book your uh, love readings or anything else. All the message, all the information on um, my readings and how to book me uh, is in the description box. Um, like I said, you can hit me up on Instagram or Twitter there. And, um, yeah, so, um, going into September, you know, just, 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 just hold your ranks and, uh, and check your ranks. All right. Make sure everybody is playing the proper position and nobody's getting, um, ahead of their britches because I think you got a few people that want to be the boss. And, uh, I think you were the boss last time I checked. Okay. All right. Aries. One.